Good morning, Team Squatching USA YouTube fans. This is Dr. Matthew Johnson with my seven-year-old first grade son, Grady. Say good morning. Good morning. And we just spent our first night at the Southern Oregon Habituation Base Camp, otherwise known as SOA, S-O-H-A. We climbed out of bed, and we are going to go and walk the trail to the food bowls so, um, we want to check to see what the um, squatches have done. So, I will follow Grady out to the gifting bowls. And we'll see um, if the squatches hit the bowls. Now, usually the first night out of the gates, they don't touch anything. Or if they do, they take very little. Um, as you saw in other YouTube videos on our YouTube channel, raccoons don't just take a little. They take everything and they scatter and make a mess everywhere. So let's look and see what happened to our gifting bowls. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. So what we have here, we had a lot of activity around camp last night with whoops and whistles and footsteps. And, okay, so what we have here is we had eight Cheeto Puffs, and now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So eight Cheeto Puffs there. Um, we had four sandwich halves in that bowl. They're gone. We had four peanut butter and jelly sandwich halves in that bowl. They're gone. We had four eggs. They're gone, except one. We um, have um, four Fig Newtons. They're gone. We had four chocolate chip cookies, they're gone. Um, but whatever hit the bowls, um, left an egg behind and um, Cheeto Puffs behind. Now, with our bowls back in Soa, um, they didn't leave anything behind. And as you can see over there, um, they moved the apple. So we'll check on that in just a bit. First of all, I have surgical gloves on, as you can see right there. I'm going to pick up the bowls. I put these out here last night with surgical gloves on, and I'm going to blow on them. And, interesting, we have what might be some kind of fingerprints inside the bowl right there, maybe. And, um... Forgive me for the filming, but it's just me, so I'm not here with anybody else to blow on the bowl. There's um, what appears to be small fingerprints on the outside right there. And those definitely were not there last night because I cleaned the bowls with water and with rubbing alcohol. It's not really... Any kind of fingerprints, and as you can see, the stick there on the ground, the bowls were left by the stick. So the bowls weren't moved, so these were picked up out of the bowls. That's interesting. A little kind of finger mark there. And then, um, maybe a little fingerprint there. Maybe a fingerprint right there. So, anyway, let's go take a look at this apple and see if um, any teeth marks are in the apple. Because if a little critter moved this apple, they'd have to move it with their um, teeth. And we have some um, what appear to be teeth marks there, or something interesting. Yeah, there and there. Okay. Um, let's look for didn't see any eggshells or any crumbs of the bread. Didn't see anything out here. I'm 
Nitrate on. And no eggshells or anything left around. No mess. This is interesting. Hmm. Well, don't see any eggshells or sandwich parts or messes anywhere on the ground there either. Okay, well, we'll see what happens um, tonight as well. So this is Dr. J signing off.